Hey Comets, hope you're doing well, and uh, it is Thursday, and you know what that means. It is time to throw back, so here we go. I'm going to take you back just one year uh, to last year when we had these cute guys. Uh, these are our two ducklings that we got. Actually, we got um, this guy right here, Ping, um, and then my, my daughters talked me into getting him a friend, so we got on. And there's on. They're so cute when they were uh, little ducklings. And, you know, you always see cartoons of little ducks and you think, oh, they can't be that cute, really. Can they? But, yeah, they actually were. They were adorable. So it kind of melted my heart. Um, but um, they needed to, to go outside. So I built them this uh, duck barn, if you will. Um, I constructed this little. Uh, grazing area, um, little chicken run, duck run. And one of our chickens at the time thought she was a duck and she would go crazy anytime she wasn't with the ducks. So I uh, can't tell which one of them, I think it's right there. Um, we could let her in with the ducks because uh, she didn't want to be apart from them. So anyway, um, I don't know, would you guys want to go see the ducks? I mean, they're out in our backyard. So I tell you what, why don't we go do that, All right? Let's just go along and let's uh, let's go see the ducks. All right, and now to the ducks. You can see we got our garden over here. It was nice this garden was here when we moved in. And you can see our feathered friends over here. There's one of them right now. There she is. That was Edna. Alright. Here is the duck barn. And there they are. Ping and on. You can see them there. I like watching them. They're kind of fun and entertaining just to watch. Not a care in the world. Just being ducks. Hey, not as cute as they used to be when they were little ducklings, but they're still kind of fun. Kind of loud though, especially on the female. Yeah, she's kind of noisy. Maybe she'll quack for us. Now let's go get a closer look. I'm gonna go through our gate here. You can see our garden. We still need to rototill it so we get it ready for the, the spring planting. Maybe in a future video I'll show you that. Who knows? Okay. I'm your math teacher, but maybe I could be your, um, your gardening teacher too. Who knows? I don't know. So, at least you get to see a little different part of my life. Okay. It's not just spent at school doing math. I like being outside and stuff like that. But anyway, enough about me. More about the birds. Okay, so they're being a little bit camera shy. I think you can see there in the barn. There's Ping and there's On. Okay, and over here are the four chickens. All right, so this brave young lady coming out. This is Edna. And right behind her is Hey Hey. Hey, hey is our oldest chicken that we have. And if the other two get out of here. Oh, here's Marguerite. Marguerite always comes with her leg warmers. She's got feathers on her legs. And then the last one is Lizzie. There she is, on cue. Way to go, Lizzie. So Anna, Lizzie, Marguerite, and Hey Hey. There they are. Pretty good life. So I'm curious. I wonder if there's any eggs. Let's find out. <gasps> but way to go, ladies. Got a couple eggs. I'm gonna eat tonight. But you know. We really do these eggs, these chickens, just because 
it's kind of what my family's always done and you know it's it's kind of a taste of my childhood but really right now it's really nice because you get fresh eggs and they're not easy to come by so pays off eggs gonna get a little bit of food thank you for the eggs this is just scratch greens we give them another more processed food but they really like this stuff Let's see if they come out for it there they are it's kind of like feeding the ducks at the zoo no well, he's Edna's hungry there's Marguerite Well, now that we saw the ducks, let's go back inside. All right, well, that was fun. Um... Just wanted to let you know, you still have the opportunity to do math yet. I know maybe it's not everyone's favorite thing, but it is pretty good for skills. So if that is something you're interested in, um, you are still welcome to do that. Um, there are the instructions in case you forgot how to get there. Um, also, you're welcome to try iReady. Those of you who are familiar with iReady know the drill. Um, I think those of you who have not yet been on iReady, it is open for you to go there. Um, but uh, again, guys, these are optional. Uh, if you're looking for some way to kind of keep your skills um, fresh and going, th these are things you can be working on. So anyway, we'd love to, to see um, some of you working on them. I know some of you guys have been doing Prodigy. That's another good option. So thank you guys for working hard and uh, keeping your math skills up. So until next time, we'll see ya.